Are you excited to go to the amusement park? There are games, food, rides, and there are awesome Ferris wheels. I am. I can't wait to go. Let's go get in the car so we make it there on time. Okay. We're finally here. I can smell the delicious cakes here already. Mm -hmm. Chocolate, vanilla, strawberry, and popcorn too. All the smells of this amusement park are just so delicious. I smell it too. But as we keep walking, these smells are starting to become less strong. Maybe it's because our senses are starting to adapt to these smells. Because of sensory adaptation. That's true. Well, even the smells of this of these treats is starting to fade. That doesn't mean we can't get one. Let's get on that ride first, then we can get one later. We wouldn't want to throw up on the ride from eating too much. Ooh, the web poster. I've heard about that all of the news. People say it's one of the most intense rides in the world. Well, the, well, the only thing that appears to be intense about that ride is the sounds coming from it. Have you noticed how much it's getting so much louder? I know. I took inspiration from a ride created by Ernest Weber. It's because we're comparing the sound coming from that roller coaster to the more relaxed sound we have yeah, heard before. This is because the sound from this roller coaster is much, is such an intense change from the sound we've heard before, as stated in Weber's Law. Oh my gosh, how did you know all that? It just says it on the coaster. Let's go back to this dam we saw before and maybe we can get some food. Yeah, I'm hungry too. That food sounds great and smells amazing. Hey guys, what would you like to get today? I'll take a bowl of popcorn with some water. I'll have some chocolate cake with some popcorn. Got it. Here you guys go. Enjoy. Thank you. This popcorn is way too salty. How much salt did you put in this? Uh, I only add a dash of salt to your popcorn. It's fine. My friend hates salt. Yes, even a dash of salt in this big bowl of popcorn reaches my absolute threshold of salt. It's small, but I can still taste it. I'm sorry you didn't like your popcorn. It's fine. <sighs> it's fine. We can go on that ride over there. It looks slow, so that way we won't get motion sickness. Sounds good. There are a lot of kids on that ride, though. Well, when you say kids, you're forming a just thought about them. These kids are of several different genders, ages, heights, and races. To say kids would be grouping them into a whole group, rather than recognizing the people individually as part of that group. Who wants to separate them, all, them by all that? That's way too many kids. But speaking of just thoughts, Look at all those fuzzy animals at the petting zoo. Oh, they look so adorable. Let's go pet them. Let's give it just like four. Hair feels really dry. It feels like it's been down a lot. Yeah, they say that most of these Karens have really dry hair. Well, as fun as it is to go to the exciting zoo, I think I'm ready to go home. We hope you guys enjoyed our visit to the amusement park. And thank you so much for watching. Bye! Bye.